Hello YouTube and welcome back to Dying Light. Last time we chopped our way through the school, made a racist joke, and are about to go chuck the jade in storage C. Which I thought would actually be a loading screen. Damn. Some lovely piss water. <laughs> Can't ruin, but can't ruin someone's day without virals. Gotcha. Didn't even hit me one time. I'm getting. Loads of piss water. So oh, you move it. Don't act like you. Would you? Yeah, sure. God, Crane, you're such an old. Why don't you just stick your head out the door and shout, Here we are, come get us! Hey, sometimes there's nothing wrong with the direct approach. Holy shit. That's plastic explosives, right? Listen, you take this stuff and get back to the tower. I'll deal with these assholes. Don't be ridiculous. We'll fight them together. And risk letting them keep this much ordinance? No, just go. I got this. Meet me back at the tower. Promise me you won't let Rahim near that high. What? Yeah, of course. I promise. I promise. Just go. and I went looking for Antizen and found explosives instead. Now we need to get the hell out of here before Tahir comes back. Oh yeah, that'd be bad. Oh yeah, that'd be bad. Oh, 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 oh
keep sharing with goddamn neighbors. I hate those guys. Uh, Seriously irritating. Such you're uh, much to hate. God, it's night out. If I can, if I can make a mad Quinn, dash, that's it. You said we needed to talk about other options if we didn't find any antizen. And we will, but right now let's deal with these explosives, okay? Okay, listen. I'll give the explosives to Saeed and you talk to Rahim. Make sure he stays away from that hive. Will do. Don't worry. Don't worry? Oh. Right. Uh. I That's kind of hilarious. Um, I apparently came out at the end of night, so it took me all night to do that. I'm fine with that. All the, all the dying light night to do that. I'm okay with that. Guilty is charged. Something I can do for you? I believe I can provide some context. You may find it useful. You may not. Okay, lay it on me. I did not witness this firsthand, so take it as hearsay if you want. But it involves his brother, Hassan. I know about Hassan. He died, right? And Rice blames the GRE? He is right, too. Hassan was confined to a wheelchair. And he was the only person in the world Rise cared about. Hassan acted as a tempering influence on his brother. Where Rise wanted to go to war, Hassan convinced him to seek peace. And when the outbreak happened, Rise demanded that the GRE evacuate Hassan first and foremost. And they didn't. There was political infighting. Because of the ministry, the GRE dragged their feet. And Hassan died in a zombie attack. The GRE could have removed him from harm's way immediately. They elected not to. And now Rise has lost his moral compass, free to inflict his brand of sadistic lunacy on the populace of Haram. So Rice's beef with the GRE, you're saying he's justified? I do not excuse him. He's a vicious gangster. A blight on this city. I merely wanted to help you understand the enemy you will surely face. Understood. Thanks. I never thought I'd say this, but but hearing that story actually actually makes me feel a little bad for Rise. You need never something? thought I'd be saying that. <laughs> uh, crude pick to destroy or di dismantle. Sorry. Still can't make no bloody firecrackers. Wonder if the shop keeps selling them. Come here. Standard issue Hellfire. Hello. Sell stuff. Ah, yes, I have things to sell. 
Y'all want some cigarettes? Smoke on the water. No oh, crap! I literally told him I would never try. I would try to never do that. Hello. Which of these do I want it on? The best one, the baseball bat. Smoke on the water. Crap, I this couldn't not use to be that done to make the tower. Oh, oh well. The Moving on. Jade called me. She's taking the explosives to Saeed. She wanted me to talk to Rahim about the volatile hive and how she wants him to stay the hell away from it. You. It's to my old pawn shop. Why am I let this be in? Used to be the best in town. Hey, speaking of the pawn shop, would I need you to bring me something from the shop. You're going there anyway, right? What is it? It's a. Don't laugh, okay? It's a Ray McCall action figure. I know it sounds silly, but it means a lot to my son. I'm gonna end this episode off here. Uh, I thank you all for watching. We're actually gonna, probably gonna do Dawood's side quest in the video because I actually went and played the game a little bit more on my own uh, with uh, Rick, Rick James, uh, and I learned a few things. And his his little thing will actually be pretty interesting because I know his uh, you only have a certain amount of time to do his. So I uh, will see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.